Hi everyone, this is Karima. I'm a dieting diva. Hope all you divas are doing good today. I uh, just started the Master Cleanse today. I'm going to go for about five days. Um, it's a little change of pace for me. If you looked at it in my other videos, I was having some food sensitivities and I wanted to just heal up my digestive system a little quicker. So after the five days, I will return to a regular low-carb diet to continue to try to starve out anything in my digestive tract that would be causing sensitivities. So this is day one. Um, it's gone pretty good. I did the salt water flush. For those of you who don't know about the Master's Cleanse, you take a quart of water, preferably distilled water, and you add two teaspoons of salt. Sea salt, preferably Celtic salt, is even better because it has good vitamins and minerals for you. And you drink that as fast as you can in the morning. Sometimes you can heat it up if that's the best way for you to take it. And then you can have um, lemonade with a pinch of cayenne pepper in it the rest of the day when you feel hungry. Also, water. So it's like a cleanse, and that's what I'm taking it for, really. I just think there's some things out of whack. I started to get allergic to cheese and wanted to do something about it. I've done it in the past. Um, a few years ago, I was allergic to soy and had really bad hives and mouth sores and all kinds of stuff. So um, when I cut it out for a month and uh, pretty much ate low carb, the food sensitivities went away. So now I can enjoy Chinese food or whatever. So that's what I'm hoping to do. And I'm going to tell you my weight loss too with it. I'm not doing it as a diet, but I'm trying to get down, getting close to my goal. Um, I can't even remember how much I've lost it for, but I, my major goal was 50 pounds, but, um, I did have a goal weight in mind before that. Was it 23 pounds? Anyway, I'm inching up on it about 15 pounds away from that first goal weight, not the 50 pounds, but this 30 some odd, some odd pounds. Um, so I got 15 more pounds to lose before that first goal, and then I'm going to do add an exercise and things like that, and probably new clothes and stuff to reward myself, and also kind of slow down on the low carb diet. You can have a few free meals a week, and you space them apart. It also helps increase your weight loss and keep you on track so you don't do any binging. So that's the plan. I ha plan to have a video a week, if, or I'm sorry, a video a day if I can get everything uploaded properly to update you each day about my progress. Um, and of course, check out other Master Cleanse videos to get the exact re recipe. I definitely didn't have it, and I really haven't been following it. I just kind of been doing a quarter, and I've been doing a lime because that's what I had. So instead of a lemon, that I used like a quarter of a lime. I squeezed it into a glass of water, and you put like about two tablespoons of maple syrup and a pinch of cayenne pepper. So that's what I've been doing. I'm not really, you know, exact on it. Some people measure it out exactly. But honestly, I've only had three glasses so far, and it's like 7 or 8 p.m. in the evening. But it's going pretty good. I still have energy. It's only five days, so um, I definitely think I'm going to make it through it. And um, I think that the salt water is probably the worst thing to get down. Um, so you just kind of have to chug it in the morning. and. Also, I would advise anybody who's starting something like this to um, do it on a day that you're off work. Maybe you're doing chores around the house because um, the whole system is designed to clean out your system. And so you're going to need to be 
your restroom to do that. So definitely don't go plan on going out somewhere where you have to use public restrooms or anything like that because um, it's definitely the salt water flush is um, designed to clean you out and when you're drinking a quart of salt water it is going to go through you completely. It's not like drinking water. Um, the salt and the water combined just uh, it's supposed to just go right through. It's um, healing and soothing. Salt just kind of has that effect on any wounds that might be in there. Any um, well, you know, you have bad bacteria in there that sometimes can eat through your digestive tract. So I'm hoping to get rid of any bad bacteria and also heal anything that might be causing the food allergy slash sensitivity. So I just would advise you to stay home for the first day. So do it on a day that you have off and definitely don't plan on going many places, especially not in the morning when you, after you've chugged a quart of salt water. So until tomorrow, I will um, update you. I'll stand on the scale and I'll give you an update on weight loss.